Welcome to Creative Suit Tutorials YouTube channel. Today, we are going to show you how to use AI movement and camera tracking features in CapCut PC. Now we don't need to manually add the tracking effects because CapCut AI can do it for us. Remember, these are pro features, so you should have CapCut Pro subscription to use them. Just click on our link in description and activate your pro subscription. This will give you extra seven days of premium subscription. Back to video now, and for demonstration purposes, we have imported this dance video, which is made using a static camera. Now we will add the movement effects to it by selecting it and going to this panel. When we scroll down, we can see many pro features. The one feature is called AI movement, and the other one is called camera tracking. Both have nearly the same use, but camera tracking gives more control over smooth dance edits. If we enable AI movement, we get these four effects to be applied on our video. Further, we have some additional controls to edit the movements. Let's apply the first effect, which is called dynamic, and it is best suited for videos which are fast paced and contain more energetic movements. The effect takes some time when we apply it for the first time, and when it is applied, we can change it to any other from the four. We have got some values to adjust here, which we can edit if we want to modify the movement. Just look at the movements, how precise they are. You probably would have seen these types of movements in dance videos on TikTok or Insta. These values are best at 50, but if you have a video which requires to change these values, you have the controls for it. Zoom movement can also be a good option for video with movements. Next, we have shake movements. The last option is for soft movements, which are suitable for videos which contain slow movements. Now we have seen all the AI movements in CapCut PC, and they are very useful for every content creator. Now let's try the camera tracking feature of CapCut PC. When we enable it, we can see three tracking options, face, body, and hand. Whichever option we will select, CapCut AI will track it and align camera motion with it. Let us do the camera tracking for body and see the results. Now our camera tracking has been completed, but it has a problem which we, we will correct by these options. As we can see that our video frame is disturbed due to adding camera tracking. And to solve this issue, we will enable this fit to canvas option. Now let's look at the video. This feature has done a great job in making this video livelier. Further, we can edit the values from here if we have any issue with the camera tracking. Now let's look at effects and filters we can add in our dance video editing.
In the effects panel, we can search for dance and all the effects will be filtered. There are a lot of pro effects which can make your video more charismatic. Let's add the glow effect as seen in most of the videos. This effect creates an outer edge glow around the subject in the video. From the transition panel, we can add pro transitions if we want. Now let's add a filter to enhance the look of the video. The Vivid 2 filter is a great one and it comes with pro subscription. Just look at the color correction automatically done by a single pro filter. There is a trending section in the effects panel, which shows all the trending effects. These effects are mostly used by content creators, so you can also experiment with these. Similarly, from the text panel, we can add lyrics or any text to make our video more engaging. We have many more CapCut PC Pro features to explore, which can make your videos more engaging. For Pro subscription, click our link in the description and keep learning video editing using CapCut PC Pro. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button for more. Stay tuned for our next video, and until then, take care.